Hola, buenos dias. This is Mr. Rhodes, and I'm going to be talking through the GCSE Spanish course that we are offering at Accrington Academy. So what is covered in Spanish GCSE? Well, you will cover themes that you've already started to look at in Key Stage 3. There are five themes, and that includes identity and culture, local area, holiday and travel, school, future aspirations, study and work, and international and global dimension. You will also develop listening, speaking, reading and writing skills, including translation to both Spanish and English, as well as learning a range of tenses and a thorough understanding of grammar underpinning the language. The Spanish GCSE is a linear qualification. All assessment is carried out by examination at the end of the course and you'll be assessed in the following skills, listening, reading, speaking and writing. Each paper is worth 25% of your final grade. Having Spanish at GCSE then gives you the option to go on and continue to study Spanish at A-level, but it also links really well with English language, art and history A-levels, as well as travel and tourism b -techs. Learning another language is a life skill and it makes you a more rounded person. It also gives you transferable skills which enhance both job and university applications. It allows you to travel and better understand other cultures and customs and this is excellent for business. It's impossible to quantify which jobs require or like you having a language, but some sectors which actively recruit people with language skills are interpreting and translation, banking and commerce and e-commerce, working for a large multinational organisation, social media companies, education, hospitality, travel and tourism. In a nutshell, if you have another language, what you have is so many more options and that's a good place to be. Gracias por escucharme. Os deseo mucha suerte. Adiós.